Um, vagus nerve class, number mm -hmm. C on page three. Um, is there something I can do in a foot bath that would be good for that? What, what is it? Uh, so vagus nerve, let me look it up. Vagus nerve class, um, no, number C on page three. Yeah, give me just a sec. Sure. By the way, I'm liking those foot baths. Yeah, aren't they nice? <laughs> We've gotten into a kick like every night we're doing a salt bath and it's just like, why weren't we doing this before? Yeah. I would take one from time to time, but... Mm -hmm. Okay, so C. Yeah. Vagus nerve and three brains. And you're wanting uh, something for a foot bath on that. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm, that's a good good question. Do, do you have some form of cedar? Um yes. Yeah, do do a cedar foot bath. Okay. You know the the thing is there's a lot of time when you do things for your feet um, you're doing things to um, unwind the spine as well. Mm -hmm. And cedar is incredibly good for the, the spine. Okay. Sometimes at right. night, um, I'll even put cedar on my spine right before I go to bed. Mm -hmm. um, okay. You know, it keeps everything moving, but, you know, as far as the three brain thing, it helps to... It it helps facilitate the alignment of the three brains. Okay. You know, it's not quick, but yeah. like when I do it, like I notice mm -hmm. it's a little bit better. Like in every time you do it, it's just like a little bit better, a little bit better, a little bit better. Like it's just, you know, you're going more for the accumulation, but it's good for the veins. It's good for your legs. It's good for your back. It's good for a lot of things. And it helps with the alignment of the three brains. Okay. Yeah. All right. Good. Very good. Thank you, sir. That's a